So the first time you open polls and quizzes, you will see a little drum roll like we just saw on screen. And then the help section will pop open right here, explaining to you how to use this feature. So this feature is going to be found under your elements. Okay, so click on elements, scroll down, and you should see a section called polls and quizzes. Then click on see all, and you will have two categories, the quizzes and the polls. Okay, let's first have a look at quizzes. And I'm going to replace this one just by deleting this whole module by another one, like a quiz that I can find here. So write a problem with a solution, with one solution here. That sounds like a good quiz. So I'm going to put it here. And obviously you can edit this quiz. All right, so I quickly created this little quiz right here, how to get more subscribers on my YouTube channel. Once you have all of your options right here, what you can do is to mark the correct answer. Okay, so you can mark this one as correct. You can move your answer up and down. And you can also add more options if you think this is relevant. And if you decide this is not the correct answer, but this one is the correct answer, you can click here and mark this one as the correct answer. People will need to click on the submit button to validate their answer. So in that case, you will need to create a public view link by clicking on the share button and then find the button right here that says public view link. So click on that. Canva will ask you, do you want to create a public view link? Yes, click on the purple button and now you have your link been copied to my clipboard and now when I come back to my slide right here and I click on my quiz and I see the responses so you click on the responses button right here you will have some statistic on how many people have responded to that quiz and what the answers have been now you can also create polls okay so again go to your elements scroll down to polls and quizzes see all and now instead of quizzes go and select a poll. I'm going to go with this one and I'm not going to customize it this time. Just want to show you that this time people will need to vote and I want to see the result of this poll. So again, I'm going to click on it and click on the response button. And now you should see face to face discussion, only one vote. So one person has voted for this option. Mm -hmm.